So guys, today in this video, we are going to compare Realme X with Xiaomi Mi A3. Realme X has already been launched in China a couple of days back and we already know the specs for it. But for Mi A3, we have leaks and speculations. But I will try my best to make it clear so that you can decide whether to wait for Mi A3 or go with Realme X when it launches in India. Just to give you an overview, Realme X is the first smartphone in this range to bring a pop-up selfie camera. The smartphone carries superb specs with strong configuration, real great cameras, huge battery capacity with fast charging and sufficient storage. As for Mi A3, it's expected to come with Android 1 branding, Snapdragon 730, huge battery, superb spec, great camera and fast charging. Now speaking of display, Realme X has a 6.5 inch Full HD Plus AMOLED display with 19.5 is to 9 aspect ratio and over 91% screen to body ratio. Thanks to pop-up selfie camera giving you more screen real estate and immersive experience and comes with Corning Gorilla Glass 5 protection. The Xiaomi Mi A3 has a 6.3 inch display which features IPS LCD technology and full HD plus resolution and there will be a teardrop notch at the top for the front facing camera. The display will feature Gorilla Glass 5 protection as well. And for your information, this is the same display that's in the Redmi Note 7 Pro. Coming to processor, we already know Realme X features Snapdragon 710 and most of the speculation towards Mi A3 suggests that it will feature a Snapdragon 730 processor which is a beast of a performer. If you want to know the difference between Snapdragon 710 and Snapdragon 730, check out my another video right after this. Click on that i button and I will link that in the description below as well. Coming to cameras, the Realme X offers a 48 megapixel Sony IMX586 main camera with f1.7 aperture plus 5 megapixel secondary camera. The camera also supports nightscape and chroma boost modes, AI scene detection and 960 fps super slow motion recording. The front camera brings a 16 megapixel f2.0 sensor. The A series smartphone from Xiaomi are quite popular for their camera performance and the Mi A3 is no different. It features a 48 megapixel plus 5 megapixel dual camera. It is the same camera setup that we have seen in the Redmi Note 7 Pro. According to Xiaomi, it provides better low light image performance. The rear camera setup can record 4K videos as well and for selfie the Mi A3 has a 16 megapixel camera. So far we can say both of these are way similar than we expected. But let's continue and check if we can find something different. The software. Here the Realme X runs on Android 9 Pie with Color OS 6 on top. Some might like it, some might not, but it packs some unique things uh, which you can find with many other Android skins. It's your preference what you like, but Android updates do pose a problem. As for Mi A3, it is an Android 1 smartphone, meaning that it comes with the stock Android OS and receives all the updates under Google's guidance. Speaking of updates, Android 1 smartphones are known for receiving faster software updates compared to other smartphones and you won't see any ads like on MIUI. The battery. The Realme X supports WOOC 3.0 fast charging. It houses a decently large 3765 mAh battery but with WOOC support. You will be able to charge the device extremely quickly. The Xiaomi Mi A1 and Xiaomi Mi A2 were criticized for having a smaller battery capacity. Well, Xiaomi has taken the feedback and has implemented the Mi A3 with a larger 4000mAh battery unit. The Mi A3 just like its predecessors support 18W fast charging over Quick Charge 4 Plus. Now let's check some minute but important stuff. The Realme X comes with in-screen fingerprint scanner as it has an AMOLED display, a dual SIM, a dual band Wi-Fi AC, Bluetooth 5.0 headphone jack with Type-C 1.0 reversible connector at the bottom. As for Mi A3, the device does not come with in-screen fingerprint scanner and you have to make peace with rear mounted fingerprint scanner. It offers dual SIM with dual VLT, dual band Wi-Fi AC, Bluetooth 5.0, infrared emitter and a USB Type-C port. 
Unfortunately, there is no 3.5 mm audio jack. At last, the price. Both of these will start at approximately 15,000 for 4 plus 64 gigs memory configuration. So pricing will be similar, only few hundred rupees difference could be found here and there. But speaking of screen, the Realme X has a great AMOLED display with full screen, but Mi A3 has Snapdragon 730 processor. Realme X has headphone jack and Mi A3 has a bigger battery. So make your choice whether you want to wait for Mi A3 or buy Realme X. So this was a small comparison. If you liked it then share, subscribe, like, whatever you want you can do it. And see you in the next one. Peace out.